switch this. There we go. Okay. What's up, Gavin here? I'm doing good. Turn the music off. We back, though. I'm excited. Because we're low-key wrapping up the mod pack. I know there's like 2,000 more bosses down here. But I think once we hit that, once we hit like this, that's that's the majority of the mod pack over here. And then just the post moonless stuff, which is insanely long. I don't know if I'll fight all the champions. Because I thought these were only uh, masochist mode bosses. So we'll see what happens there. But everything else, fair game. What's up, Deoxys? Big Bone is my next boss. Freaky Fertilizer. Some interesting items. I need my fertilizer. Freaky. Two beetle husks. Do I have beetle husks? I, I definitely have beetle husks. Early ass stream. It's like 20 minutes before I usually stream. So it's not that early. Snow Fox Double XL. What does that even mean? <laughs> Flaming Stone Cannon. I think my weapons are fine. They're fine right now. Maybe this bow I'd be willing to get rid of for like an extra ranged weapon. Because I do need an extra ranged weapon. We got the flamer already. Solar bullet. We make solar bullets. What if I make that? Let's make solar bullets. I need shells. Who sells shells? My guy over here. Wait. Yeah, he does sell shells. Let me get some shells, my boy. Thank you. Are there going to be a full playlist of these streams on YouTube? Yes. Probably. Solar bullets. Solar bullets. Just make them all. 2,000 exactly perfect. It's so nice when the game isn't lagging, but then as soon as I fight a boss, you get to that like negative FPS. It's my favorite part. Uh, what was I making? The freaky fertilizer. Okay. So boom, we got that boss ready. What else we got? Paladin spirit. What mod does this do from? The vitality mod. How do we spawn him in? Spirit box. Ooh, I don't know if I can make that. I don't know if I have. Uh, what's it called? Ectoplasm? No, I do have it. I just don't have steel alloy. What the heck? Steel alloy. Charcoal. How many? Was it five? I think it's five. So just make a bunch of charcoal. Who's throwing those loud ass AOE attack and is not even hitting anything? Who's doing it? Bro. Land a shot. Who is it? Who is this? Reveal yourself. Roxanne, spell in the dumbest way possible. What the hell? She was hotboxing herself. Do you have any plans to do a playthrough with the stars above, above mod in it? I don't know. We'll see. Right now, my plans are do this playthrough. That's the plans. And then I want to do a star do playthrough soon. Very soon. Honestly, we might start it before the series ends. I got to go through it and make sure all the mods are updated. All right, we're going to fight the Paladin Spirit first. Just because he should be easier. Probably. 
Hold on, hold on, everyone calm down, everyone calm down. Uh, what am I doing? Spawning these dudes. Keep me safe. While I come up here. Give me the trigram. My favorite thing to do every stream. Okay, sweet. My summons are low-key my carries, so I, I need them. I just need them. Hopefully, this is a big enough arena we're about to see. Bring in our boys. Bring in this. I kill everything. Make sure nothing touches me. And while we're at it, let's turn frame skip off already. Just so I don't have to worry. 78k health. That's doable. Oh, hold up, he's making kind of interesting noises. How come I feel like I've seen an enemy do that? Same exact like projectile formation every time. Where he shoots like all projectiles around him. Like I feel like I've seen like 17 bosses do this. Like am I am I, am I lying? Am I tweaking? That's the new like dash attack is a uh, boss shooting projectiles all around him in a circle. Hold up. Gather up the projectiles. Let those things go. I wonder if I can fight him at full FPS. Probably not. Look, this dude has two variations of the same attack. Respectable. At least he does it multiple times, but differently. So I can respect the repetitive attack. This dude has not even touched us. Like, maybe like once or twice. Easy boss fight. Fist, fix the boss checklist. He gotta get himself checked out next time. He's in the wrong area. That dude cut to the front of the line in boss checklist. He said nobody will notice. I noticed when you didn't do any damage to me. Summoning ritual. I have so many of those summoning ritual things. Hold up. Vitalum core. So what does this do? It makes armor. The armor doesn't even have defense. It's interesting. Very interesting. I wish it was a full on dirt class. Eh, technically. You could probably find enough dirt mods. Kraken, can I do anything with this? Nope. Okay. Get rid of that. Um, and then what is this? Murderous the Crescent Rifle. It's fast. <laughs> it's also not a rifle. Oh, I take it back. It's very interesting. Pretty cool, actually. <laughs> but I don't think it does enough damage for me to use it. DPS test it. Nowhere near enough damage. It doesn't even break 2,000. Okay, deposit everything. Boom. And now let us see what's in the treasure bag. I don't know if I'll use anything from it. Some is a lost soul when struck. Ecto soul. Keen spectral blade hunts extra nearby enemies. What the hell does that even mean? <laughs> this thing's ass. 200 base damage and it sucks. How does that work? Uh, mana incense. Plus 30% mana usage. Jesus. Q. 
can travel through walls. <laughs> that Loki is pretty good. Special shield. Increase magic damage, critical strike chance. So this is a crit mage set. I'm not using that many major weapons. I got two. Earlier, I was using a lot of major weapons. I'm kind of interested in the spectral throw, though. Going through walls? I don't know if the DPS is worth it, but going through walls? Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of good. What's up, Clamble? I'm ready, though. I'm ready to fight the big flower. Hold up. Can I make that one item? I don't think I can. Remember that one item we've been trying to craft? I don't think I can make it. Because I still don't have the item I'm looking for. They know this thing's OP. That's why they made it impossible to get. Glow Jelly. Glow Jelly. Royal Jelly. Royal Jelly. I'm going to look it up one more time. We know the answer, but maybe we just got to analyze. Queen B. <laughs> Queen B. Wow, this is using two recipes? Queen B. It's, it's, all right, here's the thing. It has to be a normal Queen B. I think that's the thing. It's a normal Queen B. It's not a Fargo's mod one. It has to be a normal Queen Bee. The problem is this dude only sells that. So is the Queen Bee. Can I turn? I can. I can turn it into a regular one. Hmm. Okay, this is what we're going to do. We're going to fight 10 of them, okay? We're going to fight 10 of them. We're going to turn these into regular ones. And we're going to see if that solves it. And if that does solve it, that just proves that Monitory is broken as hell. I finally got a good reason to go to America one day. Femboy Hooters. <laughs> I mean, it's a reason. Come on, kill this thing, like, instantly. I feel like we're already taking too long. I'm gonna get this item, okay? Oh, I did not mean to open that treasure bag. If I don't get this item, stream ends. It's an actual thing now. Drop the Femboy Hooters location, please. Wait, am I missing a treasure bag? Oh, no, I opened one. Okay. I was going to say, like, these numbers aren't adding up. I got rain. I got fire. I got, like, every element in this bitch. Where? Don't know, to be honest. Are you over here planning a vacation? You don't even know where the hell it's at. Yeah, remind me not to have you plan any vacations. You said Fembo Hooters is a thing. I'm coming to America. Where's it at? I don't know. What the? L Planner. Look how laggy the game's getting just from summoning in bees. That's a that's honestly a reasonable way for the game to lag. Because I remember I fought the Wall of Flesh a long time ago. Like, Terry 1.3, and I used uh, B nades. And my game was at, like, 2 FPS. <laughs> honestly, honestly a good reason for the game to just shut down. Literally was a thousand Bs. T 
Terraria old head. Man, I miss 1.2. See, now that's actually old head. Missing old Terraria updates. Sell everything. I don't need it. Okay. Now, notice how we didn't get the Royal Shelly a single time. I'm starting to think that item is just... It doesn't exist. The item does not exist. We've been lied to. Slandered. Libel. Whatever you want to say. It doesn't exist. And oh well, I guess we're not getting the item. I tried. I've killed literally thousands of bees at this point. Okay, not thousands. I've killed at least a hundred. I might get a banner. Do queen bee banners exist? Do boss banners exist? They don't, right? It's kind of upsetting, actually. They should. <laughs> I know there's some mini boss banners. Like, there's a paladin banner, right? Yeah, imagine in a paladin banner. It's kind of crazy. Queen B. Yeah, no Queen B banner. All right, let's fight the, the big flower. The thing is, we got to find the way down there. And I think this area is broken. Oh, wait. Oh, I think we found it. It was just a little wee puzzle. Oh, yeah. Oh, man. I can actually place stuff down here. What the hell? I have not been able to place stuff the whole time. I'm ready to fight this big-ass flower pot, but I'm going to need all my regen things. Because I'm a smart Terraria player. So, we'll be back. Let me get all my Terraria drugs. Uh, who's the dude that sells them? My boy right here, Carl. Never got a chance to beat Akram. Well, that's just like not even in vanilla Terraria on PC. So technically, I didn't get a chance either, but I did play Terraria on PS3. So I technically did get a chance. We're going to buy two of each. I'm going to put them on each side to be safe. Uh, and then what's the other thing I need? I need the, the super, the super healing. Super healing. AKA the life fruit. The life fruit. Come on. This should be easy to find life fruit. This should be no problem. That's a mimic. Not a mimic, by the way. Completely lied to you guys. Sorry. Where are the mimics at? Oh, there's a life fruit. Didn't even see that. I see. Honestly, it gives a lot of light when you swing it. Yeah, the drop is broken. We have officially solved that the drop is broken. I don't think it actually exists. Like, I don't think it actually drops. Like, it was never coded to drop. They just say that it drops. Get in there. Get that life fruit. Okay, good to go. We drop off the life root, everything else. And then we type in lantern. And then I have to make these. Oh. Somehow always running out of chains. We gotta make regular heart lanterns and then we turn the regular heart lanterns into life lanterns. Boom. And then 
I need a timer. One second timer, perfect. Damn, look how dark it got in here. What the hell? Oh, music bumping. All right, let's... Wait, I can't even... You cannot place blocks or use various tools. Then why was I able to place torches? Game of fucking lying to me. I got all this equipment for what? For absolutely nothing. Now I'm angry. I'm going to beat the fuck out of this boss. Um, let's spawn in these guys. Let's just do it. Let's just, let's just fight the boss. Give this dude his little, his plant fix. His fentanyl fix. And I'm gonna beat the fuck out of you for lying to me. Wasting like five minutes of my time gathering supplies. You stupid big ass skull. Find a, find a body, loser. How do you make fun of, like, a skeleton? Gain some muscle. Weak-ass bitch. Is that my attack or is that his attack? Okay, we gotta break all of this. I remember this. I remember that from, uh... When I showcased this boss a while back. I do remember this boss. Oh my god, I'm gonna get hit. <laughs> I didn't remember that part. Hold up, heal up, heal up, heal up. A rave has started in the cemetery? Is that phase two? <laughs> Did I kill him? Damn, I beat him that fast. You really did waste my time. Oh, this campfire is in here. So now I should be able to place stuff everywhere. Right? Yeah. So guess what? We're gonna run it back and I'm gonna have all my buffs and stuff. Get to really beat the hell out of him. Give me a platform. Uno platform, there you go. Boom. Where, 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 where's the thing at? Where is Chester? Boom. I'm not even going to place this, the secondary stuff. I need more freaky fertilizer. Freaky fertilizer. Let's fight them two more times. Wait, what the hell? Didn't I make two of them? I swear I made two of them. I even heard the noise when you click and make a second one. Okay, I guess I did make two of them. Hello? Am I missing some? What? <laughs> Am I only allowed to have one on me at a time? Uh, okay, I guess this shit just don't work anymore. Run it back. Run it back. Hold up. Let's get the little thing on him. Ow. Get the little, uh, the whip buff on him. It's only right that my minions be at their full potential while I'm beating his ass. Am I hitting him? I feel like I wasn't really hitting him. I like the noises he makes. My favorite part about the boss. Any time a Terry enemy or boss makes unique noises. Plus one. To their boss overall rating. So believe it or not, a lot of Terry bosses and enemies just use the same like stock noises. That are in the game. Kill him. Kill him before he does it. Oh my god. 
He got one hit off on me before he died. What the hell hit me? Something hit me. Something hit me when I was falling. So that asks, but you ever do a face reveal before? It hurts me more not the question, but that you don't watch all the content. That's what hurts me. I just did like four face cam streams in this series. You hate to see it. Yes, I have. Whoa, he gave me another freaky fertilizer. <laughs> you telling me I didn't have to make my own freaky fertilizer? Well, I did want to fight him one more time. Three of them? What the? Well, I did say I wanted to fight him again. I want to fight him this many times. I love this item that I'm wearing that just eats projectiles. It's so amazing. Try to fight this dude in slow mode. The game ain't lagging that much, but it will occasionally drop a frame here or two. I'm saying like a single frame. It will drop frames here and there. My summons go to work. Go to work, y'all. What even are those? What are we breaking? I don't know what the hell we're breaking. What are these called? Oh, couldn't even see. Spooky hook, I think I said. This flamethrower has been like the greatest investment in our playthrough. We made that one flamethrower, it was S tier. We made this flamethrower, S tier. One more time? Fuck no. <laughs> I am done. Wait, hold on. Go back and turn that off. Just in case this ups the like tile limit, entity limit. I don't even know what it's called in Terry. Too many things on the floor, aka lag. That. Okay, three treasure bags. I expect nothing but greatness from these treasure bags. Would you ever consider making another series like the class playthrough with the orcs again? I said I would do... I would finish the orc series if somebody ever made the Autismo texture pack for the Moon Lord. But that will probably never happen. So I would say no to the orcs. Class playthroughs, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Like, I'm technically doing a class playthrough right now with the Master Mode Summoner. I restarted up. Which I haven't really worked on because nobody watched the video. I mean, nobody watches my videos anyway, so. But that one more than the others. Uh, so that I probably don't need to whatever the fuck this is fire off homing skull wisps while you are flying or running okay so I'm kind of cool actually because my character does move pretty quick shit kind of sucks <laughs> Nasty Skull Totem Scepter, left click to summon Skull Whips that can shoot magic blasts and charge your enemies. Right click to summon Stationary Skull Idol at your cursor position. Is he just shooting at that? Oh god, I don't even know how to get rid of my summons. 
So even if I wanted to use this, I don't know how to get rid of my summons. <laughs> it still does more damage than it. Like, it's kind of crazy how good my summons are. I'm so confused. Okay, so they disappear after a while. Well, I don't know, actually. <laughs> Just die to lose the summons? Four, five, six. So, yeah, I am using the extra summon slot. Is there, like, a die button? Can I butcher myself? There's no butcher yourself option in this game. I guess we got a new summon with us. Furious Flame Orb Staff. Okay, for me running that boss three times, I did not get any loot that was worthwhile. Jesus Christ, this is mana. Dang. <laughs> That fucking plus 20% mana cost is going crazy right now. Sure. That still uses too much mana. I can't use that, bro. It's, it's too much? Don't you just click the buff in that list. Okay, what do I do now? <laughs> uh, right click. Oh, there you go. It's a little weird. It's, it's, it's a little more technical. Sand tank buff. I forgot that I'm wearing that sand tank armor. I should remember that. Okay. And then I right click. There we go. So these dudes do 166 damage. Oh god. Was it a rod or was it a staff? Does anybody remember? <laughs> rod. Oh shit. We ain't finding that weapon. Gone. Never seen it again. It was a scepter. Wrong. Whatever you guys said was wrong. Superior isn't bad. But I want higher. I need at least 15%. I know it exists. I, I can literally see that it exists. Godly? Did we finally find our new summon? Let's see. Why is there only four of them? Oh, I'm out of mana, that's why. What's that trap? There's all of them? Okay. New summons, finally. Been using those summons literally since the golem. And then the summons before that, we were literally using since the snow legion. Who would have thought using a snow legion summon? That's what happens when you have Snow Legion content. It could be good. Rune Ghost. <laughs> okay, Rune Ghost. It's got Rune in its name. It's found in the dungeon. So where else are we going to fight that thing? None other than the beautiful dungeon. <laughs> that wrong way. 
Okay, wrong way. <laughs> One of them gotta be spawned the right way. Come on. There we go. Now we get my beautiful clouds. And now I get this thing. And now there's a paladin who can completely ruin a fight. So let's get rid of him. Alright, now let's fight this rune ghost. 75,000. He has less health than the paladin spirit over the hell we just fought. I don't even know his attacks. I didn't even see any attacks. What is he doing? You like T-posing? He's summoning runes. <laughs> He's doing that. Could be scary, potentially. My boy summoning Venn diagrams. When was the last time y'all used the word Venn diagram for anything? This boss was terrible. Might actually be one of the worst bosses. <laughs> that dude did one attack. What the hell hit me? I fought some pretty bad Terry bosses before too. I'm not saying that one's like super bad, like low quality, but that motherfucker was not a good boss fight. He glitched out or something. He definitely glitched out. He had to. Maybe it's because I was putting constant DPS on his ass. Like crazy numbers he wasn't used to. I like that attack. It's a cool attack. Just a little, a little slow for him to get started. He needs like a little warm up. You know, like how you stretch before you work out. That's what he needs. He needs to get a little stretch in. I don't like that it lasts after you beat him. That's actually not cool that it's still there after you beat him. How come this isn't working? Alright, we'll fight him one more time. Just in case he does actually have like a cool ass drop. You never know. Let me use a different weapon. I'm gonna use a different weapon, okay? The flamethrower is too good. Wait, hold up. Use my missiles that I load up. Where he's at? Where is he? He's in the wall. That's why I don't know where he's at. Because he's literally cheating. A little bit longer of a fight. When I don't use my overpowered flame <laughs> I really like the noise that the, the rockets on my back make. The reloading noise. Dunk, 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 dunk. Alright, let's get the hell out of here. Got any old Nintendo RPGs that you recommend I play just for entertainment? Chrono Trigger. Uh, Final Fantasy 1 through 100. Mario RPG. Paper Mario. Any Mario RPG game, because they're all pretty good, except for a couple of the Paper Marios. that police out here no it's actually not the police you guys you gotta tell your sirens apart that's a paramedic you gotta know your sirens y'all you never know when it could be useful shadow beam staff i'm pretty sure we have one of these and it didn't craft anything that good well this could be good but 
I don't have these items. Like, what the fuck is Soul of Vitality? I don't know what the hell that is. <laughs> Weren't those first two Square Enix? Mario RPG Square Enix. If it's on Nintendo console back in the day, it's Nintendo. Same thing. All right, well, so where, where did this dude drop us? He dropped us his drip, number one. Okay, kind of messed with it. I think I'm a rocket. I think I'm a rocket. Uh, and then he got Hyper Runestone. Makes other dashes more powerful or can be used to grant a dash on its own. Makes you invincible when dashing. So, pretty much just a I Cthulhu shield, but like way better. Oh, yeah, way better. Look how far the dash sends me. Look at that. It keeps like all my momentum and everything too. Solid. Very solid. Welcome. A new accessory that I'm actually going to use. Instead of just look at for half a second and be like, oh, that's cool. I guess. Hold up. What are these? These do crazy damage. 710 damage. But do I just hold it? What was this? Equipable. Oh, it's an item. What the fuck? Ah. Kind of cool, but like, does it aim at enemies or what? <laughs> I don't think it aims at enemies. Let's see. Let's let's go somewhere enemies are. Show me that you aim at enemies, and maybe I can make you worthwhile. Yeah, I don't know, bro. I don't think I enjoy a RNG D DPS. <laughs> Occasionally, we'll hit an enemy DPS. Whenever I feel like it, DPS. Omniscient. How's that like the max thing, omniscient? We all know warding is the greatest reforge inter area. Next to uh menacing and lucky. Anything that isn't those three reforges, get it out of my face. Accessory reforges, not weapon reforges. Okay. Oh Lord. Yo, I can't wait to fight Oh Lord. Uh Rune Miner. Mine's a five by five area. Sick. But he's got weaker pickaxe power. I guess pickaxe power doesn't really matter anymore. But this is capable of mining lizard bricks. So I don't know, y'all. Well, hold up. You what? Know might as well get rid of the axe. Fuck, I don't know. You were the axe, and then we could use this. Ancient miner. Do I have that? I do not have that. Okay, never mind. Don't worry about it. Runic wave, rune blade, runic throw. Ridiculously long string. Leech Rune Staff Shapeshift Rune Nuke Briefly turns you into a, a an Rune Nuke That hurts my head Briefly turns you into a Rune Nuke That causes a massive explosion when you collide with something Now that sounds like quality I need that item Why do I have 160 penguins in my inventory? Did you see that?
What was the item that it crafts from? Ancient nuke. I need that item. Call me through the night. Ken blast. Is that an OST? Is that copyrighted? Call me through the night. Bro, this ain't an OST. This looks like this is copyrighted. <laughs> oh, yeah, it's copyrighted. I will listen to it off stream and I will refund your points. But that is copyrighted. I can't listen to it. The way you can tell it's copyrighted is uh, when you open the description of it. And then it says music, one song, and then it lists the song underneath it. That's how you know it's copyrighted. But I cannot listen to copyrighted music on stream. Or else it will mute this section of the stream. Just put some PVZ music. All right, I got you. There you go. I refunded your points. But I will listen to this after the stream. <clears throat> Plants vs. Zombies got some great music. I need to add more music to my uh, music collection for videos and stuff. I just never have done it because like my music works and it's also not copyrighted. Wabby wobble. Oh, what soundtrack is that? <laughs> what soundtrack is that? Hey. Grass walk. It's a hit. Oh my god. song underground desert or storm is yours uh the mushroom bar what other bangers do we have this is like the same song right hey. This is that Mark Rober music. <laughs> you watch any Mark Rober video, this song pops up in it. So it's like when he's like explaining something. Oh, we got it in one try. Let's go. Love to see it. I guess hold on to everything because I could craft stuff from all of this. This shit does 62 damage. Like, I don't want to. <laughs> hey! I forgot this shit turns up.
this shit go crazy. All right, hold up. Let's see this item we just made. This 2,000 damage. Rune Nuke 2018. Great year. Let's see what this baby looks like. Oh my god, I'm actually a nuke. <laughs> That's amazing. The QWERTY's mod will have some like low quality things here and there that I don't really mess with. Could be worked on. But then they got things like that. Which make it the greatest mod ever. Plantera theme is a banger. Can I reforge this? Is this a reforgeable item? Oh, it is. Sweet. 18% of 2,000 damage. That is a lot of damage. All right, I need a, I need a, I need an enemy. I need a boss. Preferably weaker. Do we have like an eyeball? Bring him over here. Boom! <laughs> Didn't insta kill him, but I don't even know. Can you insta kill the eye since he has two forms? No idea. It's a cool ability. I don't know if it's really like practical though. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I think you can since it doesn't go invulnerable. It went invulnerable. I literally couldn't hit it. When it does the little spin, it goes invulnerable. But I swear I've killed it and like Kantori bosses survived a bunch of times. But I think because in Kantori bosses survive. I'm literally using like the godliest weapons ever created. <laughs> so it's understandable. I mean, it only does 2000 damage. If we're being honest, it only does 2000 damage. It's it's a it's a novelty item rather than like a actual I'm I should use this item. Know what I'm saying? Novelty item. Because that eyeball did have like 3,800 health, I think. All right, what other things? We have an ice scroll. Okay. I mean, it's okay, but I, I don't feel like that's very useful. And then what were the last set of things we can make? We can make the Old Lord summon. There's a sniper. There's a bow. I actually might want to make that bow. Oh, you get to charge it, though. I don't like bows that charge up. I like bows that just spam. Uh, oh, Lord. Oh, Lord, summon. Can I just type it in, I guess? I got to put periods and shit. Oh, Lord. One of my favorite Terry bosses ever. I haven't fought him literally years, so we'll see if his boss fight is still similar at all. Has anybody subbed this stream? No, right? Okay, just making sure. Not forgetting any, any statues. Okay, we got warding on all our stuff, right? We could get, like, new flying at some point. But I feel like our flying hasn't even been that bad. Like, we've been using this flying since pretty early on it's been pretty stable oh my god we gotta fight the empress of light and betsy back to back <laughs> what the hell lux remember when we almost beat lux invader battleship Revisit the Sky Fortress after Plantera is slain. Shoot, I guess we're going to go fight a battleship, y'all. The Sky Fortress. Oh my god. Whatever just hit me, like, lagged out my game. 
Oh my god, what is going on up here? <laughs> what is going on up here? I have a feeling it's gonna be a terrible fight. Not because the boss fight sucks, but because look what's going on up here. Something hit me for like 700 health. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. What is that? <laughs> What's going on up here? Why is that thing so loud? What is fucking going on? Oh my god, why is he so loud? I don't even want to fight this boss. I, I lost all interest. It's like, it's like Jesus. <laughs> God seal card. What does that mean? Grants immunity to fall damage. Method going down not included. It makes you unaffected by gravity. Invader scrap. Was this his armor? It was like barely any armor. It was like a female armor set in a video game. Armor looked like you damn near naked. Okay. I guess Empress of Light it is, but the thing is, I hate fighting the Empress of Light just because of the stupid ass butterflies, bro. Uh, I already don't want to do this. You can catch lace wings, right? This is the worst part about fighting the Empress of Light. This is one of the other reasons that made me stop trying to even attempt the Empress of Light in that master mode only run. Is like, not only would the Empress of Light beat my ass, because this is still pretty early. I haven't even fought the Empress Light at all at that point. Still learning her moves. Not only would she beat my ass, but after she beat my ass, I gotta sit there for 30 minutes trying to find where her next summon was. Between 7.30 and 12 a.m. Yeah, I already hate this shit. We might just skip her. <laughs> 7.30 p.m. and 12 a.m. Wait. Okay. Uh, you know what I could do? What the? Fuck off. Wait a minute. <laughs> I did not know. I thought that was just a, a construct. What's going on with my inventory? Remember when I fought you that one time, Lux? And I did like zero damage. Do you remember? Because I remember. Whoa. Pretty lights. This boss visually is sick as fuck. Hey Lex, you remember when I fought you and I didn't know damage? Hey Lux. <laughs> you remember that? What the fuck? Get it off my screen! 
See, how do you dodge this attack normally if I wasn't able to fly around like this? You have to like get underneath or get behind the the one that's shooting the beam, I'm guessing. That's kind of hard because like that bitch is moving, bro. What the fuck? Okay, you're about to fucking kill me at the end of the fight. Those those like beams that she shot were insane. How the fuck was I supposed to dodge? <laughs> she literally put one on top of me. Those fucking monetary bosses always be trying to insta kill me right at the end of the fight. Trash ass bitch. Can't take me on fair a fair fight, huh? Look what happens, y'all. Look what happens when they fight me on a fair fight. The thing is, I almost beat her when it wasn't a fair fight that one time. When I was legit like fucking 20 bosses behind when I was supposed to fight her. Back when I had doo doo dog shit weapons. I wasn't even ready for that fight, honestly. I could have probably put out way more DPS if I was actually ready. I don't even remember what I was doing. Okay, I caught the lace swing. But now we got loot to look at, so I'm gonna look at the loot we got. This dude said budget Queen Slime. That boss is way cooler than Queen Slime. <laughs> That's honestly disrespectful. What's going on with my void? Why is my void down? Wait, where's my void going down? Why's my void going down? Is there an item in my inventory to make my void go down? Where's my void going? <laughs> Whatever. Void does zero damage. I eat that damage. Anyways, what kind of goodies did the boss drop? It had to drop something good. Dissolving brilliance. Oh, okay, it's this shit. Summons chaos spirit to fight for you. I I don't want to use void weapons. I'm not in the mood to use any void weapons. Grants infinite wing and rocket boot flight. Increases flight and jump mobility. Increases void gain. Doubles damage done to non luck spirit enemies. Okay, not really interesting, but it's just, I don't really care about anything Void related. There's not a Secrets of the Shadows playthrough specifically, so I don't care about Void. I don't want to accidentally like fuck myself over using <laughs> Void items. I could be like mid boss fight, beat an ass, and then I'll pop a void item and I'm dead. Can I do anything with this prismatic lace wing? Like, turn it into like greatness. Like this. Should I do this? Yeah, let's do that. that I like that. Make that. 
So do I have to kill the prismatic glaze swing? Did that magic weapon not use ordeal void? Which one? <clears throat> All right. Well, what kind of goodies you got? Spirit Symphony increases void gain, doubles down. Okay, we saw that. Uh, phase or the Call of Duty motherfuckers. This is the gun that I wanted to make. I didn't know how to get the bars. I don't really feel like making a weapon where I had to click to shoot. Hyperdrive. I don't even know what the hell this is. Second charge of a crusher? What the hell is a crusher? Who's making that noise? Stellar Serpent Launcher. I feel like that low key might be good. Because it uses the Piranha Gun and a bow. It's got to be good. Bag of Charms. It's pretty cool. Too bad it's a Secret of Shadows item, so I don't even know if I can get my hands on it. The drops are kind of broken. What is that noise? Who's doing it? Piranha Gun Snake Bow. Snake bow. Oh, I can make a snake bow for sure. Okay, I lied. I can't make a snake bow. What am I missing? I'm missing just a regular wooden bow. Regular ass wooden bow. Is that possible? Can we make that? This thing better be good. And then I need a key, but not just any key. I need to flip one of my buying keys into another buying key. I have a hollowed one. Don't I have a crimson? Yeah, I have a crimson one. I need a jungle one. Any 10 jungle banners, I kind of mess with that recipe. That's the only way I could get it. Are you kidding me? Bro, that noise. Yo, what the fuck is that noise? What mod is this? My bad, I didn't see your message. Ruiz, exclamation point mods. I missed a lot of messages because I was fighting that Lux boss when I wasn't even supposed to fight her. Okay, um, I need to, well, what do you guys think? Should I just go to the jungle farm until I get a jungle key? Or should I just do the 10 banners? I don't know if I have 10 banners, so there might be farming either way. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five. Five, six. Well, I don't know if that counts. Yeah, that counts. Six. You missed my music request? Did you do it in the middle of a boss fight? The wind is blowing. Cavi Cape. Oh, shit. I want to play this game. I was about to play this game. Or one of these games. Hey. Hey. I guess we're farmer bosses. We're enemies. While listening to this. Where's the item? of death. Let's go to the surface. 
Might be easier. I feel like royalty this movie. Oh wait, hold up, switch it up. Hey, hey, hey. Oh my god, the FPS. Oh my god. <laughs> Momentarily just vanishes. Alright, hold on. My ears hurt, I'm not gonna lie. I was blasting that shit on full volume. No, let me just turn my headphones down. So do you guys think we get the key first or we get enough banners? It's looking like we're going to get enough banners. But I feel like we'll randomly scoop up a key last second here. I think we have enough banners. off all the enemies here I fucking died surprising mm. I'm all tab I was like why is it taking so long Let's geranium wasp banner. I don't think that one's gonna count, huh? At least it hangs. The funny thing about a uh, moderatory banners, is they don't they don't got that wind blowing effect like all the other vanilla banners. <laughs> so you can really tell when one of them's a modded one. Stiff ass banner. Stiff ass. That's where I put all the stiff ones over here. Underneath our gambling area. The music's bumping, I ain't gonna lie. But yeah, I was about to play uh, one of the Mario and Luigi games. But then I decided on What's the, what's the game I'm playing right now? Uh, Shadows of War. Shadows of Mordor, I mean. This is a good defense with that. Shadows of Mordor is pretty good. And like the first like minute, as soon as the game started in Shadows of Mordor, I died to like two captains. They just kind of like pulled up on me. Or I was trying to kill somebody. And then he blew a horn. And then two captains pulled up on me. <laughs> And then both of those captains had like 30 dudes with them. So like in the first second, I like died. And those two captains got really strong. I killed them though. So they ain't that strong. All right, hold up. Let's absorb all the items. Did we get a key? Hell no. Wait, what was that? Jungle chest. Some say jungle mimic. What the hell? Keep that, I guess. Why is that just laying on the floor? Other items. Okay, we got life fruit. Love to see it. Life fruit actually useful as hell. Oh, a derpling banner. How the hell did we miss a banner? Turtle shells are always good. Can't go wrong with turtle shells. Hold on to it, actually. Hold on to that, too. Deposit everything else. What other goodies do we have? A golden grasshopper. Why do we have a golden grasshopper? 
sell it. It's fine. And we got a nasty turtle one. The hell? Fucking Koopa? Namek? No, not Namek. That's Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> Kamek? Who, what's the dude from Mario? It's Kamek, right? The magic, the magic one? What should it say? Test. Shell Staff. What's up, Matthew Higgins? Are you related to T. Higgins in any way? Matthew Higgins? Turtle Ages. Grants immunity knockback. Maximum life increased by 50. Increased damage reduction as your health decreases. Honestly, a great item. Don't take a lot of damage. This is also a great item because you literally throw turtle shells. Same thing with this one from the Spirit Mod. Used to be one of my favorite weapons was that turtle shell. Yo, I could turn a turtle shell into a tortoise. Tortoise cannon that also uses the piranha gun. Why does everything use the piranha gun? And no, and I do not know T Higgins. Sorry. Damn. He's a football player. Really good. All right, jungle chest. Let's fight a jungle mimic. Why not? What you got for us? You gonna drop like a red potion? Oh, shoot. Vine Slinger? It's from Fargo's mod, so it probably actually would have been OP if I got it earlier. Everything from the Fargo's mod is OP. That's just how it works. Okay, so let, let's count up our banners. I might need that turtle, ba turtle banner. So that's five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. What was I even making? I was making the key. I was making this key. Jungle key. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Huh? It's not counting the hornet banners? Bro. Are you kidding me? Is it because there's two of them? D that's literally a jungle enemy. I don't care if it's an above ground jungle enemy or an underground one. Because the spider one's an underground one. The man eater is. That's fucking bullshit. Scamming us. Okay, I gotta turn that turtle shell into a banner. Wait, can I not do it? Turtle. Am I tweaking? Didn't we see a recipe like that? I guess I was fucking tweaking. Oh no, we could get a turtle shell from a banner. Not the opposite, bro. Well, I guess we're going back, right? I'm sorry, I'm British. See, out of context, that'd be hilarious. All right, somebody give me video game music to listen to while we farm. This is a freebie. This is a free recommendation. <laughs> if not, I'm listening to PVZ music again. Risk of Rain 2 soundtrack. Remember when I played the Risk of Rain DLC on stream that one time? <laughs> is that even on YouTube? I don't even know if that's on YouTube. That might be a part of a second channel video. <laughs> but like the end half of the second channel video. So I don't know where it is actually. Okay. This doesn't look copyrighted. This sounds scary. I need some height. I need some that I want to farm to. This don't make me want to farm enemies. Well, look. It's got potential. This music hurting my ears. Give me a rhythm. Here we go. Yeah, this 
just ain't hit it. <laughs> just ain't hit it. I'm not gonna lie to you. Beachside dream. Okay. I can see me killing enemies. Where are my summons at? That was so many fish I just killed. This makes me want to be inside Bowser. Or whatever the fuck the game is about. Something like that. Bad pigeon speed. Giant tortoise. I'm gonna need one more banner. One more banner. God damn. Alright, there you go. Take it off. Music off. My ears hurt. Playing too many noises at once. What the hell is this big ass staff? Spore breaker? It's gonna be that big ass staff, and then I'm gonna look at how much DPS it does, and you'll be 12 damage. <laughs> Watch. Watch and see. 48 to 120. It's a club. You get off easy this time just because you're a club. All right. Now we should be able to make this key. There we go. If this key doesn't end up turning this item or the piranha gun into the most OP item ever, you will be very upset. Now, here's the problem. Have I even seen the, the, the biome chest? I don't think I have. Eye chest. I don't even know what the fuck that means. Like an Apple iPhone? Okay, what y'all got down here? Come on. I gotta go exploring back in here. I don't wanna be in this damn place. I've done it all. I've seen it all down here. Whoa, 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 whoa. A lot of chests like right next to each other. Thulu, the mysterious trader. Not Thulu, bro. Frost chest. We're getting closer. I feel it. I will just put a bunch of torches around it. Might as well. I, mean, I don't think we're going to use the frost chest. Hey, I saw that you could go over here. Oh, that's how you get it. There's a door down there. Only time I'm I need a biome chest and I can't find it. Open the door. Open the door. Ah. I hate it. Just trying to walk in a direction. I feel like I've had to see it before because, wait, hold up. We could go over here. There's only so many areas I haven't been. What is this? 
fuck is this? <laughs> is that a pteragram hanging like above you? Kind of sick. I want a sword hanging above me. I can't sit in the chair. Pteragram. Everyone's favorite most overpowered weapon. Just kidding. Pteragram does not hit as hard as the Arcalis did. I'm not even talking about like numbers wise. Like it ain't hit home as much as the Arcalis did. When I find the Arcalis, I'd be like, yo, Arcalis. When I find a Pteragram, I don't find a Pteragram. So I can't even make it a, a fake scenario of me finding it. Yo, when was the last time you ate sushi? A couple months ago. Definitely last year. Actually, no, that's a lie. It might have been February, last month. Forgot. Yeah, last month. Then. That shit was pretty good because it was all you could eat for like $20. I think that's the best type of sushi places. You got to do all you can eat sushi. Because regular sushi places just, they don't compare. They might be a little bit better, like, uh, taste-wise, or maybe quality-wise. But you're spending, like, quadruple the money. We spent $20. We got, like, there was, like, five of us. We spent $20. We got, like... Hundreds of pieces. We took out a quarter of the ocean. Sushi is filling. But uh, we're still going to take out a piece of the ocean. Eating. Gas station sushi be giving me the shit. That was wild. I'm mean, actually eating gas station sushi. Like, you're asking for it at that point. Guys, I'm starting to think this chest doesn't exist. Wait, what's over here? There's water and spikes. Awesome. Also spikes. Well, you never know. Maybe at the bottom of the spikes is something. Nope. Okay, so the problem with the chests is that they're not different colors on the map, which is what I just noticed. Look at that. That's kind of crazy. Why is that like that? I feel like that's like on purpose design because even the gold chests literally have fucking colors. So why do the, the buying chests not have colors? That's 100% a design feature by the Turi. That was just something they would do. The hell? The Turi developers are pro grind. They want you to grind more. They want you to do monotonous tasks over and over again. So I can't put it against them to not actually have that as a feature. <laughs> right up. Big J in torches by the jungle chest. It's fine. Just putting torches around it works. Like I know it's there. Because look how much it sticks out. There's literally a golden barrier around each chest. Any way I can find I play this mod pack. Yeah. He got you. Still got you. Aha! We found it. And I was zoomed all the way in. Just had a feeling that it was down here. No golden barrier today. I did get a cool banner though. Oh my god, I'm missing so many banners just because I wanted to make a key. My banner collection is ruined. Remnants of devotion. 
Okay, so who doesn't have decorations? Here you go. Yo. That's hard, bro. Shadow Wizard Money Gang. Or what the hell are they called? Yeah. Shadow Wizard Money Gang. That's hard as fuck. I ain't gonna lie to you. Who made that? What mod is that? Or is that Vanilla Terraria? It's Vanilla Terraria? That can't be Vanilla Terraria. There's no way that's a Shadow Wizard Money Gang reference. Huh? Shadow Wizard Money Gang. We love casting spells. Tergrim do anything? Not really. Okay, what's inside of these dungeon crates? Even though I don't really care. Okay, Piranha Gun. We went all this way to do all this work for this damn Piranha Gun. What does it do? Make a tortoise cannon, which I don't care about. Or we can make the stellar serpent launcher. Launches a starlight serpent, which homes on enemies and attacks them repeatedly. What do y'all think? Because apparently we only get one of these things. <laughs> does this say what this does? Charges up tortoises? Lost my interest with charges up. We're making the stellar serpent launcher. What's the name of these bars? Phase bar. Are you fucking kidding me? What? <laughs> you need 30 to make three bars? Does this like spawn now? Secrets of Shadows phase bar. That shit ain't even come up when I talk. <laughs> Does it spawn in the sky now? Did it say something about spawning in the sky? What is that? Anyway? New item. Starlight solidifies the upper atmosphere. Look at all these enemies. Godly dragon horns. Phase bar. Sound like a like a chocolate bar. <laughs> Oh, whoa, it's like invisible. It's kind of sick. That's cool. Okay, Secrets of the Shadows, I see you. Other than your insanely toxic enemies, I see you. With the creativity. Oh my god, and it makes a cool noise. Awesome. <clears throat> Suck it all in though, because I don't feel like walking around and picking it up. What the fuck? I quadrupled my inventory. Wait, what is that? News or anything? No. Nah. Uh, phase bar. We need 24. Easy. All right. And then Stellar Serpent Launcher. Of course, there's a battery forge. Why wouldn't it be a battery forge? <laughs> Why wouldn't it be a battery forge? <laughs> Give me something crazy. Well, hold up. Let me turn this wiki off. I can't see anything. 
Deadly. Spend all my money on this. <laughs> Wait. Is Unreal the best one? Oh my god, I got Unreal three times. Oh, I got it again. Okay, whatever. Says, when is Unreal the best Reforge? Yo, yeah, get rid of this bow. I don't want this fucking bow anymore. Okay, this thing did not seem that worth credit. <laughs> Yes, let's fight the Empress Light. Kill in the hollow bind, which can be found nighttime. Right nighttime. Let's boom, turn that on. Got our summons, get our clouds in the air. I actually might need better wings, but we'll see how this fight goes first. Because you actually need the airtime for the Empress of Light. How about the Hyper Light Geyser? Are you, is this like an OP weapon that you guys know? So we keep on telling me to make it. is this recipe you want me to make this <laughs> oh we got dissolving brilliance why is there even two different recipes one of them is way easier why would i do this recipe is this a better version <clears throat> we'll worry about it later empress of light time My favorite boss to fight, especially during the daytime. Look, I would have died right there. This was the daytime fight, I would have died right there. Oh, did she get hit by a star? Yeah, how's that feel? Why she got these damn beams all the way up here? Yeah, I would have died right there. <laughs> would have been two deaths already. Three. Four. Five. No phase two? Did she got phase two? Or maybe I just killed her too fast and I didn't notice. Would have been like a good handful of deaths against the daytime Empress. What is this? Gilded Coffin summons a mummy to follow you. I'm good. I got my boy Chester. Better than a mummy. Sorry. Mummy. But it's true. Bottle of Assorted Fairies. Okay, that's kind of cool. She got in the treasure bag. Chalice of the Empress summons a squire. But I'm not using squires. Uh, what else we got? Hold up. Where did it go? Just clicking on it gets rid of it. Night glow. I don't think I've seen a soul use this. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you, I didn't even know what this weapon did until I clicked on it. Heavenly Cross. 
just true damage. That actually might be OP. Sorn in Insignia, I know, is pretty good. Prismatic die. I hate dies, if you guys know. I feel like most of the dies in Terrier just make your character look stupid. Which I like my character looking stupid, but you look like knockoff stupid. Okay, so she's the one that drops Rainbow Essence. I don't know what Purification Soul is, but this armor set is pretty OP. That's all I know about the armor set. Very, very good. Okay, let's make this geyser that you guys want me to make. 24 phase bars and a photon geyser. Photon geyser. Is this on my craft? Okay, photon geyser is a drop. It's a secret item. So how the fuck do I get it? The chest? Wait. I hate when the enemies die in the wall. Not only do I hate when enemies go through walls, I hate when they die in the walls. So you can't get their items. It's like, how annoying can I be as an enemy? <laughs> Sold by Strange Transmissions. Is that what this is? I'm not going to backseat it. What do you mean you're not going to backseat it? Just fucking tell me. You guys want me to make the gun? I don't want to make the gun. <laughs> is this the portal thing? I got to open up the portal? Gems. That's not what they're called. What are they called? You gotta type in large. Uh, we did amethyst. You need to break a red crystal in the pyramid and then put it above the stone obelisk at the ocean at midday. Red crystal. What's the name of those things? Is it not just called crystal? Crystal in the crystals in the middle of the fountain near the entrance of the furrow. Well, I broke that shit already, didn't I? Or no? Over here? Any stronger pickaxe? Keep hitting it, it spawns stuff. See, how would I ever figure this out? It's kind of cool though. But I definitely would never have figured this out. Kind of sick. <laughs> secrets, secrets of shadows. They be cooking when they don't got a hundred other enemies flying through the walls and hitting you. What is that? Lucky cursed apple. Whoa! Should got a description too. Yeah, but if I didn't get back seating there, I was never gonna figure this out. 100%. <laughs> All right, what the fuck are we doing now? I put this above the thing at the water. So this thing over here. A 
at daytime. How do you guys know this? You're fucking secret, secret shadow developers. Nimble sludge staff. Throw it on a set of platforms. Like I never would have got that. You don't. Need, you don't just click it. You throw it on platforms. Wait until noon, okay. Sleep in my bed. Game Raiders IRL moment. Maybe get rid of the giant wave so it doesn't get blocked. I have to get rid of its own structure. It's interesting. I don't need to break the wall, but I'm just making things look nice. If this wasn't a long playthrough world, I wouldn't have even did that. <laughs> Honestly, I just found this from a video. It's interesting. Me and Vortex get a little freaky from time to time. It's also interesting explaining it like a blocky boppy. Like this doesn't even say anything. It doesn't even say like wait until noon and something will happen. Wait until noon and then get naked in front of the obelisk. See, that's what I would have did. But I feel like time is not moving. Something's going on. It's not moving as fast. Blocky Bobby. My boy. What's going on? Why, why is it throwing like <laughs> Why is it doing that? Why is it bouncing? Why the fuck is this thing bouncing? Why is it bouncing? Jesus Christ. Is that it? Did I get it? A bit closer? Close, y'all. I don't know. <laughs> Just literally right on that bitch. Missed your window? Alright, so this shit's stupid, is what you're telling me. Cool up to the point where it's stupid because it's so specific. Well, if only I knew that this shit was a fucking bouncy ball.
7 p.m. What the fuck? All right, enjoy the gameplay. I'm about to just sit here and look at my phone. I'm not going to look at chat, but just type in chat when it's like 11 a.m. I even sleeping like well why why I feel like the time is not moving at all. Don't bounce like a bouncy ball. Don't bounce like a bouncy ball. Test like right on that bitch. <laughs> that is right on it. Literally can't get any better than that. Sick. Sick. I didn't mean to break the obelisk too, but mine now. All right. Okay. Cool, cool. Is there a range weapon? Oh, you gotta let go too. Ah. What oh, shit, curved? You can sell the crystal for big bucks. It's not used for any other Easter eggs. Damn, a whole platinum. A little decoration. A broken obelisk. All right, let's make this uh, super geyser. If this geyser doesn't solve all my problems, then stream ends right away lazy can I get like a godly I have not gotten marvelous a single time I don't think a marvelous one exists I think I would have gotten marvelous once by now. You know, I might just have to take Mystic. Damn. That shit gotta hurt. Is that low key a JoJo reference? Yeah. Hold on to it, my precious gem. Summons a pet ghost pepper to assist after combat. Plunder two souls of looting from every killed enemy and stores them inside your void meter. Right click on an enemy to mark it for harvesting, consuming 10 souls. Mark enemies drop extra loot. Enemies can be marked multiple times. Requires 100 souls to mark a boss. Some rare enemies will also require more souls to mark. What the fuck is this item? <laughs> what is this item? I feel like I just read like an infomercial. I 
All right. Ugh, I really don't want to fight Betsy. I really don't want to fight Betsy, but... You got to do what you got to do. Wait, I can't even... I don't even have enough medals. Can I get defender medals? Like, can I return my items? This is bald bastard up. Sixty. Oh, okay, I could afford these. Should I just get these, the aura staffs? We feel an explosive trap or lightning. Where'd you go to make the new armor set? I can't. Because there's like more shit I don't have. Ballista sweep. Ballista is not that good. <laughs> just, just because the number bigger don't mean it's the better weapon. Had to break it down. Take the lightning staff. All the other staffs are sleeper staffs. The first wave, though, I'd rather take ballista or flame burst, but. Don't sleep on these. Wait, what happened to all my money? What? I'm so fucking confused. <laughs> what did I just pay the reforces? <laughs> Can I have a donut? If you subscribe, maybe. All right, this is what we do. We got my cheat code weapons here. <laughs> there you go. We win. I don't have an attorney here, Chris. gonna beat a one try it's not master mode so I should beat it one try yeah I'll put a vote up okay put a vote up for all my gamblers will I lose against old one's army yes no prediction is up oh my god where is the fps at nothing's even happening why is there no fps Still, the only reason why I don't put the peas in certain spots because I don't know where the portal okay. spawns. Like, I have no idea where the portal on the right side spawns. Damn, the, that was a lot of coins on no. 56% 50 of all the money's on no. Please lose. I really want to suggest music. You think I'm going to lose. So, you saw me just destroy the Empress of Light. 
like half a second. God, the game is fucking lagging. Like, bad. Do you see how dominant this performance is already? And you think I was gonna lose? Why can't I place this? It won't let me place it. Is it like more than 10? No, it costs 10. What? what the fuck? Is it like a range or some shit? You think you're going to lose? No means you won't lose. He literally said, please lose. I want to suggest music. I was talking to that guy. Hold on. Let me use my new weaponry that costs 8 million mana to use. It actually doesn't cost that much mana at all. Bro. The lightning is the greatest thing ever and the pea shooters people were talking shit about the lightning fools i call them hey i fucking saw you Them damn wyverns always trying to find a way to sneak in. Oh, look, a fucking wyvern, bro. Of course, the, the fucking wave is over, but here's a wyvern sneaking hits in the back line. I got to turn this off. It was fine at first, but she got too bad. Hit him with that beam. How that shit tastes. Need more homing. Need all my weapons to start homing. We need no nobody getting past. Nobody's allowed. Watch, I'm gonna come over here as a wyvern. I'm putting lightning on it itself. So if anything even gets that close, they're gonna take big DPS. Big deeps. What's up, Jaguar? Big deeps. But let's just litter the field with it. That's really all that matters. What wave are we on? Four? We still got a while. More projectiles. I want my game to operate at negative FPS. If it's not negative FPS, that means I'm not playing it right. I'm out of mana. I actually ran out of mana using this. What do you think of the new mace, by the way? Do you think they should nerf it? Hell no. More weapons in Minecraft, but the better. There is no reason in hell for anything in Minecraft ever to be nerfed. It's a majority, like, not PvE game. With very shitty PvP. It's like Terraria.
Yeah, and it's a actually cool weapon. So they better not nerf it. Look at how slow the game is moving. I actually like this. I can read all the attacks from the games, I guess. Terraria got worse PvP, not gonna lie. I hope it's better in Terraria 2. That don't exist. And I hope they just take PvP out. <laughs> I hope they don't even think about PvP. There's no reason for Terraria to be PvP. I hope the thought of PvP doesn't even cross their mind. Okay, we got flying bomb guys. Yeah, look at that. I know these motherfuckers were snooping around. Let the beam go! Who's still alive? The, the wave is over. And there's a whole ass boss still alive. Okay. This is our final wall of defense here. Boom. Boom. Literally just fill in all the cracks that don't have lightning. What's wrong with PvP? What's wrong with Terraria PvP? It's dog shit. <laughs> That's what's wrong with it. A while, a long time ago, like during, I think probably peak COVID. Hey, where the fuck are you going? During like peak COVID 2020, maybe 2021 actually. I was invited to watch a Terraria PvP event with a bunch of other uh, Terraria creators. It might not have been creators. It might just been people a part of Terraria community. And oh my God, was that it was fun interacting with the people there. I had no problem with that. But oh my god, was that PvP so fucking boring to watch. I don't even know what was going on half the time. Because they were off the screen 90%. So that didn't help either. So if you're asking what's wrong with Terry's PvP, it's just not good. Period. That's it. That's all you need to hear. There's no other explanation that needs to be said. It's just, it's just not good PvP. Yeah. It's like adding PvP to a game that doesn't need PvP. <clears throat> Have you played Helldivers 2? I'm debating on getting it. Yeah. Helldivers 2 is cool if you got people to play it with. And like that's the only game you have to play. <laughs> it's a little repetitive. I didn't know it was as repetitive as it was. Cause the way people were hyping up the game, they're like, oh my god, this is the greatest game ever made. But then I played it and it was like, oh my god, this is the most average co-op game ever made. It's not bad. It's a good game. It's a great game. But it's definitely not no what the hype made it sound like it was where it sounded like one of the greatest co-op games ever made I did PvP with some peeps. Yeah, it's fun to fucking mess around and do PvP, but it still don't mean that this shit's not trash. Like, motherfuckers could love eating human beings. Motherfuckers could love cannibalism. That don't mean it's a good thing. <laughs> if you want an analogy. Eating people to fuck with the homies. Me and the homies when we eat a human being. So I fucked with it. Uh, will I lose against the old one's army? No, I didn't lose. So I choose no, right? Okay. Shh. 
shameful brand of the inferno shameful is right because who the fuck uses this? <laughs> it doesn't even have like anything to combine it with so i'm getting rid of it that shit has a shield hold on i got a betsy trophy you know what i want this shadow wizard money gang picture in my 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 room my sewer i mean Hope you like banners, because I got you three of them. Defender's Crystal. Summon a crystal that lets you access your Defender's Forge. P-Bone Utility Portable Storage's items are very broken. <laughs> it's highly recommended you don't use them. Dangerous. Dangerous. <laughs> Stay away from that. That thing is dangerous. They warned you. That shit sounds like it was about to self-destruct on the spot. Moving all the ninja turtles over here. They just kind of don't fit. And also they look scary as hell. Because I couldn't get the paint right. There you go, buddies. Heroes in a half shell. What does a half shell mean? Can I paint their head? Did I ever test that if I could paint their heads directly? Great. Half shell like oysters. I still don't know what that is. <laughs> People compare hell divers with Warhammer. Uh, Warhammer, what, Vermintide? Yeah, I guess you could say it's like Warhammer, Vermintide, or Dark Tide in terms of like killing things. Betsy wings. I might actually need to make this, but the thing is, I need to kill the Moon Lord for it. So I don't know. We need to get better wings at some point. Summons homing flames when using any weapon. Increases acceleration. Whoa. Increases max number of sentries by one. All attacks put Betsy's curse on enemies. Some good items. Betsy's curse. What is this? Oh, it's a spawn point thing. Or are they referring to them being half turtle? Well, aren't they full turtle? Aren't the fish run wings very good? I know Betsy wings are good. Fish run wings are good. But those are vanilla wings. We want something delicious. Modded wings. Hey, let me see this Betsy flame. Fuck. That's the type of flame they meant. Let me just go over here real quick. Dude, it's so laggy. I'm not really seeing these Betsy flames. <laughs> I don't know how useful they are. I like the noises everything makes over there. She said, Doom. Betsy's curse. Is, is ninja a species in the TMNT canon? <laughs> no idea.
Do you think Multiverse is gonna make a comeback? I don't know. There's just better fighting games out there to play. And I like Multiverses too, it's kinda cool to mess around with, but... <clears throat> I think it, if you're somebody that actually like enjoys platform fighters, you just play Smash. Smash is the platform fighter. There's no reason to play any other platform fighters. Hold up. Okay. Who do we have to fight next? We did a lot of bosses. Big Bone, Spirit, Ghost, Empty Light. There are like six bosses. I'm scared to fight this guy. <laughs> Just because there's so much chaos going on up there. The cultists. You know, I have to fight the cultists. There's an old lord. Subspace serpent. He might actually be my ass. Is the journey mod in this? Homeward journey? Yeah. Okay, let me go up there and spawn him in all the I'm sitting fucking crisscross episodes. Where's he spawn at? Right. Open up. Open up. Okay, come back home. <laughs> Wait, how do you uh, uh, How you, how you fight? God seal card. Car. Yo, he sells life fruit. I keep forgetting. That boy Carl got them hookups. Wait, didn't I have an extra lantern already? Mm, mm, mm. Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson, who winning? No idea. I will not be tuning in. I recognize that boxing slash fighting is the most boring sport ever. Every time I watch it and want somebody to win, they never win. Or every time my friends tell me, like, oh, this dude's a dog, he then gets their ass beat. We find him? What is that? That ain't no damn spaceship. Who is that? Get the sentries down. Get the sentries down. Okay, thank God there's like no 8 billion enemies fighting us. Kind of a cool fight that used the terrain here. But I have a feeling that this boss didn't even really expect all the terrain to be this bad. So I kind of feel bad for him. I don't even know what's hitting me. Look at the curving bullets. Who's hitting me? Like action. Oh, he's shooting projectiles. I didn't see those little ass projectiles. What the fuck? Ow, what the <laughs> That shit hurt. What is going on? What is happening? What is going on? <laughs> Game tweaking. Game tweaking. What is happening? Bro! <laughs> oh.
See, I told y'all that we did not want to fight this boss. I told y'all we did not want to fight that boss. <clears throat> the fucking game almost exploded. Ruthless Invader Caster Staff. I'm good. <clears throat> kind of doesn't help that that enemy that spawned in randomly did like what 300 damage with a laser it's a little bit insane so we go from one impossible QWERTY's boss to the next oh lord <laughs> will this be a better fight Will I be able to win? Let's see. So, oh lord. That's a little overkill. How much mana it takes just to spawn in six of my minions? <laughs> Why does the staff cost so much to even seven eight minions? Wait, I used to avoid this spawn I mean. What is that? What is that? What is that? Why is there a star just randomly? <laughs> Whatever. I don't know what's going on. Okay. Get rid of this. I don't need this anymore. Uh, sure. Drop these guys down. Even though I don't think they're going to matter. Do that. Nimbus up in the sky and let's fight oh lord but let me turn off frame skip oh lord this dude is big he a top five big terraria boss oh there we go lock it in what do i hit what am i hitting this is just a dodging phase right now. I did not fucking dash. What the? I just dashed and lost a bunch of health. <laughs> oh, there we go. Beat his ass, y'all. I ain't worried about these little meteors because I got... How am I dashing? I just need to use a homing weapon and just pay attention to dodging. What just happened? Oh, he's so the little the little red circles. That's the boulders coming at me. Or what are the little red circles? Do I just take damage if I get hit by? Them? No idea. Summons beat his ass. Hello. God damn. Big ass boulder. Yeah, I had a feeling they broke into like miniature ones. You know what? I got an idea, but it might be hard to set up. Hold up. Fuck. There you go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now that's what we're working with. Wait, what's going on? <laughs> My sentries are being launched around, bro. Sentries aren't supposed to move like that. I don't even know where my sentries are. Where are they? That time I actually wanted to dash. I'm low key like invincible. Except for gigantic lasers that hit me. Cause like, look, I don't, I don't take damage from these boulders. Oh shit, I didn't know his eyes were. How do you think the game would look if I uh, turned off the cap? A little bit more enjoyable to dodge 
But look, as soon as he puts like 30 projectiles on the screen, it's just going to slow right back down. I don't like this attack. I'm getting like pulled around. He's launching my sentries around. I don't appreciate that, bro. Mr. Lowered. These slow ass lasers ain't going to hit me. This is a cool boss fight, though. When I first fought this dude a long time ago, this boss fight was sick as fuck. Yo! The boy got that beam. This reminds me of like a Binding of Isaac boss. Real like roguelike bullet hell type boss. God, I dashed too far. It's weird how you're like, your character is not connected to the camera. Which that never happens in Terraria. Your character is usually always connected to the camera, except for when you're like at the edge of the world. Ow. <laughs> Do not bump into the walls with the spikes on them. What's that noise? Oh, that's my, my my pea plants, but they're underground. I'm, run, I'm running out of location here. Oh my god. Look at this. Look at this. Is this playable? I don't even know what's happening. God. Insanity. You think I, I'm playing with like Intel integrated graphics? It's so smooth though when we turn it off. I like it. <laughs> Nice and smooth. Ow. Damn, that boy got projectiles in this bitch. It's all good. I literally deflect them. Need a ter Terraria deflection class. Not like in like Oblivion, you could build like 100% deflection in that. Need that for Terraria. Need more broken stuff in Terraria. That's why Terraria isn't the greatest game of all time. Can't break it. It's always too, like, maintained. Like, it's a MMO, RPG, PvP game. Remember when Mage was, like, the god tier lifesteal class in 1.2? Yeah, great times. I remember that very short moment in 1.4.1, I think? 1.4? No, it might have been 1.4.3. Where the whip subclass was the greatest class ever. <laughs> That teleport into something. Find the sweet spot. Literally can't get hit right here. Yeah, this dude is tanky as shit. 270k health. Motherfuckers want to be like, oh, why doesn't gamer just play? F Masochist mode or master mode. Because I got shit I want to do. Like walk around my apartment back and forth for no reason. But instead, I'm here stuck fighting Oh Lord for 10 minutes. At least he's not that hard. 
He's more of a cool boss fight than he is a difficult one. I guess it might be a little bit more difficult if I was playing at full speed, but we literally did play at full speed for a little bit. It wasn't that bad. If anything, it might have been easier. Because I could read all the holes and stuff in between the projectiles a lot easier at full speed. God damn. That big ass boulder. There's only one attack I'm worried about is that giant laser. If you get hit by that giant laser, you 100% just die. Just gonna teleport out here. <laughs> Can't hit me. Can't hit me with the giant laser. If that giant laser isn't an insta killer, I'd be upset with the mod. Oh lord, he's dead. Clay man. Clay man. Make it daytime, bro. I'm tired of this upsetting rain. Turn the rain off too. Come here. It's a video game. Remember when Calamity Mod had that one glitch where it would just rain 24-7? What mod is this? Exclamation point mods. We'll show you the mod list. Who's the LeBron James and Terraria NPCs? Mm. It's gotta be the Goblin Tinkerer. Goblin Tinkerer is a very controversial uh controversial NPC which I think fits the motto perfectly who's the Isaiah Hartenstein of Terry NPCs the cyborg <laughs> long ass fight yeah that was a long ass fight at least I didn't die at the end. Okay. Why, why do I keep getting penguins? Where do these penguins keep coming from? I'm like sneaking penguins in my inventory. Rod of command used by your Quan lords to issue commands. What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Whoa. A century? I don't know who your Quan is. That is not a century. I don't want to use this summon. <laughs> I don't want to use this summon. This summon is banned. <laughs> he is banned from our use. Hold on, let me see some. Where's our, where are our summons at? Where are our actual summons? Soul Skull? Like the eye twins there you go oh my god i swear to god i clicked wait i remote is that what it's usually called oh my god <laughs> What is happening? 
Why do they low key do crazy damage? <laughs> Why do they low key hit hard as hell? <laughs> what are they even saying? Does anybody know what they're saying? The launch fighters? Lunch fighters? Whole spiders? Hold up, hold up, hold up. We putting them to the test for real. Spider-Man is a modded boss. This is crazy. This may be the greatest turn up I've ever used. <laughs> we found our greatest weapon. Louder than the deer claws. You just gotta suffer from the from how loud it is just because of how strong it is. The lunch fighters. <laughs> launch fighters. It's gotta be launch like L A U N C H. Launch fighters. <sighs> Launch fighters. Launch fighters. Okay, that is a S tier weapon though. We just had to see the greatness in person. That's going to be my go-to weapon when I'm struggling. I'm like, damn, this boss is hard. Oh, you know who we can use that against? This stupid-ass spaceship. <laughs> Moves you towards your cursor when you use. What the? That's not what I thought it was going to be. Wait, hold up. <laughs> what the? Now I'm moving. I was moving until I ran into all that shit. God damn. Oh my God, get this shit out of the way. I'm trying to fly. Dude. Now this is Terraria. When I think of Terraria mods, I think of items like this. I'm about to make another stupid ass video. Like today's video. What if I had like this in the Omega Breaker from Thorium? Like would I actually zoom across the map? That's beautiful. Hold on to that. It's a great item. Great item. Alright. Everybody that has ears... You might want to uh, close them, open them. I don't know. You might want to close them because we're going to do some crazy shit. But first, before we do that, I actually got to make a, a mushroom bomb real quick. I don't know where we're going to make this mushroom, but right here is fine, actually. We're going to make a mushroom biome just to have stuff growing. Get this ready for the future. We're going to kill the... What's his name? Fishron, but I, I just need Shroomite for 
some stuff. Shroomite cartel. They should make the mushroom people the cartel. <laughs> I should be in charge of Terry Laura. The game would be so much more interesting. Okay. There we go. Let that grow. Now let us go destroy this boss. And I expect nothing but instant death against this boss. And negative FPS. Murderous. Give me, just, give me a crazy reforge, bro. Dude, I'm running out of gold. I need to farm some gold somehow. Whatever, we'll, we'll take deadly. Was it a card? No, it wasn't a card. Well, it was a card. It's not in there. See here. All right. Sorry, get rid of the, the skulls and bring out the fighters. The lunch fighters. Where the fuck? Let's get it. I'm not taking that out this time. Close your ears, everyone. It's gonna be a loud one. Come on, y'all got it, lunch fighters. Kill this guy. What's happening? I'm gonna break your Terraria with one mod. Kill him. What is that? Like, why does my screen go downwards? Oh, okay, just hit me. Kill him, please. I'm not even wearing my fucking thing. Is there a phase too? I don't know if I can do it. Tell my time out there. What the fuck? You shoot a vertical lasers. Horizontal. I mean. There's too much going on. Something's gonna die though. I have faith in it. What the hell is going on? Why am I upside down? Where am I? <laughs> Why am I not moving? This might be the most insane Terry boss fight I've ever done. <laughs> Invader, no nap. And now I gotta fight this dude? Is this like seven bosses? What the fuck is it? 
Yeah. Dickhead. Yeah, beat him up. Wow, what the hell? <laughs> Why did that hit me? Yeah, fuck that boss. I never want to fight that boss again. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That was like six boss fights in one. And that dude didn't even have like a health bar I could stare at. Yeah, I'd rather fight Nameless Deity to fight that thing. <laughs> what is this? Soul of Height? Whoa, what the hell? 400 damage. Seraphim Predator. Yeah, I'm not using no damn weapon. This is Predator. In it. The higher beings will see you as one of their own and not attack you. Oh, so I could wear that up there? The higher beings. Launch fighters, launch fighters, launch fighters. Stop. <laughs> no more lunch fighters, please. Well, we'll use them in the future. But for now, no more. <laughs> Say, shut up. Don't sleep on the lunch fighters. Fight kit. Has a variety of different attacks based on right click slash right click in directions press. Enemies when hit will briefly have their contact damage turned off. Proven mobility is significantly. I'd recommend not using mobility items with that first. Yo. <laughs> I'm moving. Am I just throwing my sword? Do they mean left click or do they mean right click? What the fuck? <laughs> what attack is that? <laughs> Imagine standing underneath this attack or standing above this attack. <laughs> Sit on the toilet. See what happens. Invasion caller calls back the fortress invasion. <laughs> the Vaders will see you as one of their own and not attack you. Okay, so just a bunch of shit. Or dudes won't attack me. I mean, this is some cool stuff. This thing does a lot of damage. Invader shooter? That boy got the invader shooter. That's it. The fuck. All right, so we pretty much have like conquered every boss, but Moon Lord and Subspace Serpent. We might as well just fight our boy. Uh, the cultists. Might as well. Sorry, everyone that's over here. You guys might get caught in the crossfire. Come on, come here. Let me hit you. Boom. 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 Look how much damage he's doing. Because he's getting straight up penetrated. I told y'all this was a strong attack. <laughs> Just sat there and straight up <laughs> violated the Moon Lord. There ain't no pause. I did what I had to do to him. Oh man, I don't like how close the solar one is to my house. <laughs> what the hell was that? Bro, look at the attack. What do you mean, what the hell? Look at that attack. <laughs> Stand under this attack and tell me you can take it like 10 times. We'll read everything in a second. First off, I got to kill this pillar. Tama, 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 tama. Okay. 
We'll just deal with the low frame rate. It's fine. So my favorite thing about the solar pillar is how like everyone agrees the worms or the crawl to peeds are the worst enemy. But then like the Terraria five head geniuses are like, just don't fly, they won't hit you. Meanwhile, every other creature in this event is on the floor, which encourages you to fly. I just think it's a really funny thing when they say that. I like using this weapon because it sounds like I'm making Christmas music. You know, let's go back to using these swords. Because you saw me just obliterate the moon or the lunatic occultist with it. So technically, I should be able to obliterate everything else. Oh, yeah, look at that. Right click throw. Okay, I take it back. I don't want to use that weapon anymore. <laughs> use the geyser. Geyser activate. Geyser attack go. I'm about to die. Homie. Geyser activate. That's how you really do it. Y'all just kill this thing. Just kill it. See if I had my lunch invaders out, we would have already killed this. Faster, y'all. Faster. Kill it. Taking a lot of damage. Why are they taking so long to kill this thing? This just proves the lunch invaders are our best summon. And I have to use them. It's over. Dead. Rest in peace. I died to that thing? It has like half the HP of Oh Lord. Yeah, it's fucking crazy. I'm bringing out my secret weapon. I'm sorry, chat. How fast that was. Did you see the speed in which we completed that? Stop. It's dead already. Launch fight. <laughs> the bulge biters. You will not disrespect the launch fighters. Oh, I have no storage. We done ran out of storage in this bitch. Alright, let me actually look at all the items. And then I think it is a good time to call it quits on the stream. This actually might be the biggest progress jump we've had in the stream. Because next stream, we start off pretty much fighting Moon Lord. We got like one more boss than Moon Lord. Right? Yeah. I probably... I don't know if I have to make a Moon Lord arena or not. I might have to. I don't know. We'll see. That or I just expand one of my arenas to be taller. You know, give me all the almond milk that's in this bitch. Selling it. I don't use void. All right, let's read these items we got. Uh, we got brutal arcane defense rune. 
Mounts do contact damage while not moving fast. Kind of pointless at this point. Be useful. Different playthrough. Uh, ritual syringe used to turn bloodless steaks into blood candy. What? I don't even know what that means. Arcane magical tablet increases movement speed by 15%. Critical hits release magical projectiles. 15% movement speed? Don't fucking move and look at this. Critical hits release magical projectiles. I mean, it's cool, but I don't really care about the speed. Look how fast you move with these dual wield swords. Hold on, let me put this manipulator away. item I can take out. We got Elder Weave Scarf. 20% reduced mana usage when under half health. Increases maximum mana by returning when above half health. Uh, crit chance. Magic attacks. Occasionally release bolts. A powerful ancient magic that mounts off the of walls. Does not sound terrible, honestly. And then we got the treasure bag itself. Summons two mini cultist minions that fly next to you and fire shadow fireballs. Sounds sick. Yo, me and the boys, Shadow Wizard Money Gang. We love casting spells out here. All right, hold on. Actually, bring in some enemies. They're actually not bad. They actually shoot decently fast. Okay. Could be in a decent item. We got Lunatic Bow of Ice. Fires out an ice arrow alongside two to three regular arrows. Which rain down icicles. Low key. Low key could be a decent weapon to use. And then we got this shit. Which obviously. Oh my god. This makes a lot of things. A lot of things. And then what is this? Neutron fragment? This is the bubble class. What did I say about the goddamn bubble class? I ain't using the bubble class. It's not happening. Bubble class would never be used by me. Alright. You guys know what time it is. End of the stream is gambling time. Let's satiate everyone's hunger for gambling. Sure, I'm kind of hungry for some gambling too. I'm hungry like IRL because I haven't ate. And I'm hungry for gambling. Where's the golf thing at? Oh, it's up here. Let's make sure you get a test hit in. That looking good. Prediction is about to go up. Prediction is up. If you have not been here for the gambling, I'm going to hit this golf ball a bunch of times in the first hole with the flag to land in one of these holes five times, except for yellow. Yellow is only two times because there's one flag. So whatever color gets the ball to land in the hole five times wins. I have to mix up the flags again because we're getting to a point where only certain ones win. I just rocket a hit in. Bro, come on. Ooh, 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 ooh. That doesn't count. I, I was just seeing if I could blast the hit in. Okay, starting now. 
Let's look at our predictions. Damn, Blue only has one person with 10 coins. The most voted is green. Yellow doesn't even have a soul on it. If I could, I would I would do uh, yellow. If I could vote. All right, officially starting now. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. See, that's why I can't do full power hits because stuff like that happens. Damn, that shit got some bounces. Blue already taking a great lead. But green said, let me get on the map. Let me get on the map. Let me get on the board. And same thing with red. Now, question is, will yellow also make an appearance? Probably not. But blue honestly might just run away with it. Oh my God, yellow made an appearance. <laughs> How rare for a yellow appearance. Maybe we change yellow to just once. Oh, blue's about to win it all. Blue taking the victory stale as usual. The smartest gambler in here. Okay, red is on there with two. And there you go. Blue takes it. The 1% of all the money on blue. And it all goes to stale. Congratulations, stale. Again, winning everybody's money. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. 12,000 gain. Oh my god. <laughs> or not 12,000. 1,290 gain. All right, what do you guys want? You guys want golf again? You guys want the NPC one? Or do you want the slot machine? Golf, slot machine, NPC machine. Golf again. Okay, golf it is. This is our final gambling thing. You know what? We're officially changing the rules of yellow. It only has to land in yellow once. And I'm moving yellow over here. That's the new rules. It only has to land in yellow once. Two times is, is hard. So we'll do it once. Just to make it more enticing for people to want to choose yellow. I'm fucking starving. Okay, predictions in. Predictions are in. Okay, well... There's no... All right, well... I'm going to just end stream then. <clears throat> Thank you, everybody, for coming to stream. We will stream probably tomorrow. We'll see. I might not do mod pack stuff tomorrow. Maybe we'll just do, like, a Terry challenge. We will see. Get this fucking lightning staff out of my inventory. Why do I have this? What am I going to do with a lightning staff? Used it once. I don't need it.
بیا سیاه نشیم 